redeeming the image of Africa all over the world. Okay, hello my wonderful people. Yeah, today is a very special day. And uh, here, I'm with someone very special, a YouTuber, a friend here in Ilorin Kuara State, by name, Teresa. Teresa, welcome to Arenga TV. Thank you. How's everything? Everything is fine. Thank God. Yeah, uh, we want uh, Teresa to tell you people about uh, our channel. And I will want each and every one of you to go and uh, subscribe to Teresa's uh, channel because I've seen, you know, Teresa doing a lot of uh, wonderful lifestyle uh, videos. So, kindly tell them about your YouTube channel. Hi, everybody. My name is Teresa Adido. I'm a YouTuber based in Ilorin, Kwara State. And I create a lot of content videos on my channel, lifestyle, and based on the fact that I stay in Ilorin, so most times I go around places in Ilorin to show most of my subscribers, especially those that have not been to Ilorin before. I create um, tutorials and some gists most times, and I do some DIYs to my channel. You can see that uh, Teresa has been in the system at least for a while, though it might not have been there for long. However, we've been together to the Emias Palace today with Teresa. It's like Teresa has a sister here too as well. That's Esther for you. Yeah. Yeah. I also have a, a tour guide as well, who happens to be Omoto Shaw Aki. <laughs> Hello, everyone. Oh, yes, yeah, so faces of Ilori. I'm Ilori Tianu. I've been having a nice day here, but I don't know. Is there any special place that you want me to visit here? Um, I don't know if you have been to Unilori. We have um, Chop Right at Fatawa Mall, Palms Mall. Then there is another village close to this place, I think. Uh, Ariata Village or something. So they do a lot of fishing around that place. It's very close to this place. Where we are presently is called Asadam. So this is um, like uh, the dam that controls the water supply here in Unilori Kwara State. I don't know if there's any other thing you want to ask me, but I think you've answered most of the questions that my subscribers would love to know about you. So that is uh, Teresa, my beautiful wife in Ilorin here. <laughs> uh -huh. So now I'm going to ask uh, Teresa about uh, our challenges. You know, it's like she was trying to tell me something one-on-one -on -one before about vlogging, you know, uh, in Ilorin. Tell me your experience, the one at Ah, <laughs> um, Vlogging in Lauren is kind of stressful. Maybe I'll say maybe the locality I found myself. So most times when I'm vlogging, I'm like, you know, raising my phone up and doing something. People will be like, what is she doing? Who is this? And the other day I was at Ojaba and someone even tried to snatch my phone. It was... <laughs> I was actually scared, like, ah, guy, what happened? He said, ah, I didn't try to take it, all those stuff like that. And apart from that, maybe due to the environment where I stay, there are some times I want to make videos, and before you know it, a ghost can come to the back of my window and start shouting. Or somebody outside might just start playing music. Or in the middle of the video, just say, kukuruku, ah. I'll be like, oh, God, what was this? What was happening? <laughs> Again, um, Nepa. When you want to... You know, when you're in the mood, like, okay, let me do this, let me film this video. Never will just take their thing. I remember when, when, when they restore the lights, the vibes won't be there again to, to do anything. So, those are some of the challenges I've been facing, actually. But, Ilori is a good place if you want to come. But just now, like, people will look at you. Yes, Ilori, we like, love to look. That's it. They will look at you, so... That's the only thing. Another question is this. I noticed that here in Ilorin, there are ways that you dress that people will definitely raise eyebrow. Or as a lady, have you been facing such challenges or what? Yes. 
like when I was at the Emirates Palace, I have to use a veil to cover my head. Because those kind of places in Ilorin, you can't just dress anyhow. Maybe putting on the trousers and the top. You have to, just like what I'm putting on, you have to dress, like cover your body, cover your head. So um, most times when I um, go out and maybe I'm putting on something that to them is not decent, it's not modest, they tend to look at you. So they expect you that as a lady, you are supposed to dress properly, you are supposed to cover every part of your body, from your head to your toe, you are not supposed to expose anything. <laughs> so for those of you that wear mini skirt and bumper, Ilorin is not a place for you. I, I love to ask you questions. She wants to ask me a question. I just want to ask that how has been your stay in Ilorin? Because I believe that we are welcome a lot of people here so i want to know how well you've been treated where you stay since you've been in lorry okay that's a good question yeah like i said right from the first day i got here i the hospitality that i received made me to say that uh, lorry is now my second home yeah because um in fact the people here, they are so friendly. They just love seeing new faces. And they are happy. They are always willing to assist you, to show you direction when you miss road or you need any help at all. That is one thing that I so much appreciate here in Elorin. And I would love to visit here more and more. So for our viewers, so you can see, if Elorin is a place you can visit at any time, they are very friendly. Welcome visitor, yeah, we will treat you very nicely. So, that is it on this uh, uh, video. And I hope you all enjoyed this short interaction with uh, Theresa. So, till we come your way with another interesting and wonderful video from Teresa. So you see our faces on your screen again. Make sure you stay safe. Make sure you keep our social distancing and remain blessed. And um, subscribe to my channel. Don't forget to make sure your, your face mask and share this video with your friends. Subscribe and for our returning subscribers, say a lot of thank you for always coming back to our channel. Thank you. And uh, from me, I say bye bye and uh, oh, double.